Good afternoon. My name is Therapy. I'm a teacher of Burmese. Burmese is the language spoken mostly, if not exclusively, in Burma. It is the largest member of Tibeto Burman family of over 250 languages. Nearly 70% of the population in Burma speak Burmese as their first language. But other ethnic minorities such as Kachin, Karen, Shen, Hmong, Rakhine and others speak it as their second language. The official name of the language is Myanmar, but Burmese is more commonly used, also as a protest to the current military regime, which changed the name in 1989. Locals, however, use Bamasa when they refer to the language. Burmese has two forms, formal and colloquial. The formal style is mostly used in official publications, media, and other formal occasions such as weddings. But informal or colloquial style is used in everyday conversation. Usually, particles and sentence endings mark the difference between these two forms. And like Western languages, Burmese is tonal, and verbs are usually found at the end of the sentence. It has four tones, namely creaky, low, high, and stopped tone. For example, la, 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 and le. The first la is a moon, la is to come, la is a donkey, and the stopped tone, le, is a hand. Burmese has its own script, consisting of 33 letters, which you can see here. It also has 14 vowels and 9 special symbols. Since Burmese does not have standardized Roman transliteration, it is worth the trouble to learn the script if you want to understand and pronounce the language better. Here is an example of how the word Burmese is written. Now let's learn how to speak some Burmese. How are you? How are you? Yes, I'm fine. What is your name? My name is Nicola. What are you doing now? Now I'm learning Burmese. What is this shop? This is a fruit shop. What is this fruit? This is a banana. How about this one? This is a mango. That's all for now. Namaste.